Hey, many fish. It's the 21st of August, 2019. And I had to just do something very quickly on this study that links fluoridated water during pregnancy to lower IQs. Now, this is something that they have known for decades, since before they started forcing it into your water that it lowers IQs, right? And they're just spelling everything out right in front of you, right here even. I mean, look at the imagery, you know, the DNA, the formulas, the uh, Baphomet star, the digital and biological combining together. You know, fluoride's just been a mechanism for them to dumb down the population. And now they're soft disclosing that it might lower IQ during pregnancy. It's just unbelievable, folks. Fluoride can actually help with your tooth decay if it's applied topically. You know, drinking fluoride, ingesting fluoride is akin to ingesting sunscreen so you don't get a sunburn. You know what I mean? It's pathetic on its face, but this is the level of evil you're dealing with. The deception goes so deep that doctors and all these studies that have been done, you know, on fluoride, knowing that it lowers IQs, they're all deceived. It's just diabolical, right? So I'm doing this video, I go outside, and sure enough, they are turned the sky into soup this morning, right? Probably spraying fluoride for all we know, right? 21st of August. I don't get out and use this camera very often, but I just wanted to show people, you know, the chemtrails have not stopped. At least not here in Maine they haven't. Especially towards Boston, down south. But, I just wanted to show you guys that because, uh, they haven't stopped. And they're not going to. So this is like, ten minutes later. Can you see the moon there? The moon's like, right there. Well, all that stuff right there, that's what the chemtrails turn into. And it looks like the clouds, like, on Jupiter or something. There's a new formula that they're spraying. And they quite often, they'll spray now that they'll open up their nozzles for a few miles and then shut it off. And so on and so forth. Creating what appear to... You know, people who don't know what clouds are supposed to look like, they just think those are clouds, when they're not. Not at all. They are, they are doing something so diabolical, people, it doesn't matter what they're spraying up there. They're not telling you, they're lying to you, and they're deceiving you, and it's designed to kill you and imprison you. That's all there is to it. So... What's the deal, right? I mean, what are you to do when you see this level of evil that's just creeping from every nook and cranny imaginable? I'll tell you exactly what you do. You call on the name of Jesus. That's what you do. Pray you all have a blessed day. Peace and grace to you. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, 